as we celebrate our seniors, I'm taking a deeper dive into one of our guys who bleeds green and gold, Donovan Jennings. I'm Kaylee Trell, your Bulls Insider. Your son has such a rich history with USF. How has it been for you to watch him grow with this program? It's um, it's almost like surreal. Like I can't believe it. I can't believe that I raised a son that's that good and that dedicated to a university. It's just like I'm just so proud of him. It's been really cool because it's like I remember his first press conferences and how awkward he seemed in his first press conferences. <laughs> And, uh, you know, as to now, he's like, you know, like a seasoned vet. He handles himself so well. When and he broke his leg, and I thought, oh, my gosh, we have to keep him mentally tough through this, right? It wasn't necessary. He had it. He's like, Mom, I'm going to get better. I'm going to go back. I have just been impressed with him every step of the way. It's his dream, and I love watching his dreams fulfilled. What's it like playing alongside Dono? Oh, big, uh, big Dono, big 73 car. Uh, you know, I love playing next to Dono, uh, not just in football, but as a person. He's a great guy, always bringing a smile to my face, not just me, but to the guys in the room. And he also brings like that veteran presence, you know. He knows what he's talking about when it comes to football, so just having him in the room, it's a big boost of energy and also a big boost of knowledge, too. Playing beside Dono, he's a guy, you know, he always keeps the energy high, holds everyone accountable. Uh, he makes it fun out here, you know. No matter the kind of day you're having, he's just, uh, he's always going to keep you going and keep you working at your best. He plays with so much heart. Can you talk about his drive and passion? Donovan's been like that since he was a little boy. Like, Donovan was always a big little kid. So, he'd be, he'd be around other little smaller kids, and they, whether they'd be swimming in the pool or playing baseball or whatever, he always wanted to compete. So, it's like, whatever group you put him with, he's always going to compete. As a tackle, it's nice having someone with so much experience on the other side that I can go and kind of ask questions to and get some guidance. That's the biggest blessing is just having someone that can give me answers I need. He's the leader of the group. He has the experience. He has the knowledge. He knows everything. So he usually he keeps the group together, and he's just a great guy all around. What's your favorite part about watching him play? That he doesn't get beat. I watched him for five years now, and I can never say that I've seen a game where he's been dominated. Donald's a great mentor. I mean, he's helped me a lot. He's helped me gain a lot of my knowledge about the game, and uh, yeah, I love playing next to Don. He's a good man to play next to him. I can't wait to watch him next year in the league. Dono, man, he, he's a vet. And, and, uh, he, he, br he brought me in when I was freshman. He said, oh, you can do this when my first start was, and he was very encouraging, and uh, he's, he's been the same guy since I got here, and uh, his smile just lightens everybody's day, and uh, I, I like that boy, Dono. It's going to be sad, sad when he goes. Number 73. I try not to get, I'm like, don't get emotional trying to think about it, but it's like, it's just, uh, I'm just very proud of him, very proud of him.